Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. It is Spectre here. Um, in the last episode, we built a, a beautiful cactus farm. Um, I have AFK'd a little bit in between episodes. Um, I also, you know, changed that area. Changed this, I think it looks a lot nicer. I think this whole vegetation thing is going so much better. But uh, here's this uh, cacti, cactus, cacti, whatever you want to say. Here's the farm we made. Uh, 45! Cacti in here. It's a lot more than I had thought there was going to be, honestly. Uh, here's the sugar cane. Here's the bamboo. This is all great and all. Um, just in the future, I'm trying to lay out as many of these plants as I can. Uh, this road, it's getting extended, of course. It's over there now. I built. Oh, 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 this is the best part. I built a little staircase over here. Oh my gosh, I'm in love with it. It goes right up here to the wool farm. I've got this little road here built, and yeah, I'm, look at it, oh my gosh, it's so cute, I love it so much. Um, in the future, I don't know when, I, I don't know how, anything like that, I want to have this road, uh, it starts going this way, I want to have it curve all the way around the lake, I think that'd be cool, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but eventually, someday, I might. I want to try a stream, a, a, a stream, I don't know if I said that right the first time, uh, sometime, I don't know when, but you know, that's that's all in the plans. Uh, anyways, in today's episode, we are going to be adding a new farm right over, I think like here, and then we can build the path over this away and make this area look kind of pretty, but uh, I think we're going to build it like right here. In this area, maybe here. Oh, it's here. Why does it always start raining? It did this. Oh, it's thundering. Don't know how I did that. All right, well, I'm going to skip the thunder. Uh, should I skip the thunder? I'm going to skip the thunder. I got nothing thunder related to set up or anything that can help me. So I'm just going to go ahead and skip it. But today, we are going to be building a, uh, interesting, we're going to be building a uh, honeycomb farm. Uh, because Not because I need one, but honestly, the honeycomb blocks look so cool. Um, I can get honey from it if I build it differently. And also, you know, I can make candles with honeycomb, with the wax type stuff. So that's what we're going to be doing today. I don't think I have any dirt on me, which might be a little bit of a problem. It won't be a problem. I'm going to take out some of this hill anyways. All right. So here we go. We got tools. We got, I don't think we need our pocket. That's just full of stuff I've been terraforming with. We got our construction box, which is an amazing choice on my part. Here's what we're going to be working with today, I think. Um, we're going to need our shovel because we're going to be pushing this hill back. Of course, I'll make it pretty later doesn't really matter right now, I don't think. Just gonna go ahead and push this back. Oh, this looks hideous, but what the heck? All right. Now, I have a, like, a little bit of an idea what this is gonna look like, but nothing like, nothing big. I don't, I don't really have a big idea. So we're gonna go ahead and set up I wouldn't have set up nothing, I guess, because I completely forgot. Alright. So, three and two. So, alright, I'm trying to... I'm trying to imagine what this is going to look like again. I should have built this, like, on a separate world first, just so I could remember how this works, but I did not do that. So, I don't think it matters all that much. Alright, so we got dirt here. Oh, we got lots of grass on us, actually. That will be great. So, we're going to go ahead and start off by doing this thing. Do we have dark oak wood in here? We do not, but we do have this, so it's okay. We're going to grab a stone cutter. We're going to grab... Some of these just uh, just for now, right? Yes, that's will work. All right, 
So I'm trying to imagine what this is going to look like in my head again because let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Let's go five, I think. We'll skip one of the corner. We'll go here. Oh, no, I'm doing this wrong. All right, and this will go five in this direction. One, two, three, four, five. Is that five in between? That is four in between because I cannot count. All right, we'll go there for now. And of course, all this in the middle is going to have to be taken out. Ooh, cool. Don't really need it at the moment, but cool is cool. Cool is cool. There you go. Said it right that time. Gosh. Uh, is this, this is five. Let me just skip one there. We go there. Like so. And uh, then this will be five in this direction. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. That goes there. Which means the next block will go over there. Uh, let's see here. Okay, I think it's turning out okay so far. In my head, at least. You guys have no idea what's going on, but that is okay. Uh, let's see. That's going to go there. We might be able to make this a lot smaller as well. Just depending on how this, uh, how this progresses. I'm going to build that up a little bit. Okay, I think this hill does need to get pushed back so we can start building a little bit more in here. Uh, we'll do this. Alright, sweet. That goes like that. Nope, it does not. This goes like that. And then this one over here would be like this. And this is five. Perfect. All right. So here's the general shape of the build we're going to be doing. Um, we need to... The floor is definitely going to be different, but we can change that here in a second. Do that. Get rid of that. Actually, I think that can stay for the most part. Do this. All right, let's see. Okay, let's get the let's get the general farm set up real quick. Uh, we're gonna keep this on us. We'll get some cracked wood, like s cracked bricks, like so. We're gonna grab this, these, that, and uh, yes. Okay, so we're gonna find the center here. We're gonna go. The garage is opening. That's cool. That's fun. All right, let's go here. Um, this will go like this, like that. Okay, so just pay attention to what I'm doing here. So we're gonna put uh, six blocks down like this. We're gonna put dispensers facing, no, okay. We're gonna put dispensers facing this way, facing us. Uh, we're gonna put beehives, which we did not grab out. Uh, we're gonna put bee nests. Hopefully these bees don't try to kill me, and if they do, that's too bad. All right. Yes, all right, bee nest goes like that, like that, and like that. Perfect. Now, I hope there's bees in here. Are there bees in here? There's bees in there, yes. All right, so we're gonna have observers facing down like this. I don't like how that looks. All right, why, why are you shaped like that? Is there a way you can change that? I want the, no. I guess they're always facing like that if they're facing down. That's annoying. Maybe I'm just not understanding this correctly. All right. Well, they're going to be facing down. Uh, then redstone is going to go on like this. Okay. And then we're going to put shears in these like so. Similar to the bull farm. So every time a bee flies in here and um, the beehive becomes full of honey, it will the observer will see that. It will trigger the redstone down here and it will harvest the stuff inside now the question is did i build this too small i believe i built this too small meaning i won't be able to get inside this thing hmm that is that is a that is an issue, 
perhaps. I was going to build a building around this thing, which was part of the idea. But seeing how small it's going to be, I have a different idea, I think. I don't know. Should I change it? Should I not? I probably should. Hmm. I'm thinking, I'm thinking really hard. Alrighty, everybody, welcome back to the most inefficient bee farm you ever will see. Alright, so we have the same basic design. We have the the observer looking at the beehive and the redstone connected to an, uh, a uh, dispenser here with uh, shares inside. Alright, so here's the next thing we gotta do here. Uh, now that that's done, I, put a, I have a block here because I don't have another beehive. That's just a temporary block right here. Um, the next thing... Next step is building a a like legitimate like you know thing around here. So uh, I'm going to put these three high, and I'm going to do this and that, and I'll do one wall just so you guys can see. But then I'm just going to speed it up again. Uh, we're going to do this number like this. That I need, I need one more. Just give me this. Dang it. Okay, just, just put that. What is pushing me forward? Oh my goodness. Come on, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Right there. Okay. So right here, I need. I've got extra spruce wood, right? Yes. Cool. Do I have crafting tables? Yes, I always have crafting tables. I always have too many crafting tables. All right, so we're gonna do one of this. We're gonna do one of that. We're gonna get two of these. We're gonna do this. We don't have enough, so we're gonna do that. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do that. All right. Okay, so we're gonna do this, that, 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 and then we're gonna do this to make this shape of a window. That is suddenly out of place. Yep. That's pretty much it. And then once we have like honeycomb stuff, we'll put it on the side there. Until then, we'll just put like this wall, I guess. Um, but yeah, here's that's the basic idea for that part. It looks weird right there because of the thing that's facing the wrong way, the stair. We're just gonna fix that real quick. Uh, like this, like that. Perfect. All right, how does that look? I mean, honestly, horrific. But that's okay. We're not going for perfection. We we never go for perfection. All right. So after that, this will come up here. It'll probably stop like here. Actually, let's see. No one has to go higher. And then we'll do a stair like so. And then how about a half slab? Will a half slab work? Where's the stone cutter? We'll do this. That's a cracked block, so that doesn't matter. Go this. Go that. Okay, let's try this out. How's that look? Well, I miss it up, so horrible. So we're gonna do this, that. 
Honestly, it doesn't look any better, but uh, I think that's what we're gonna go with anyways. Let's see what I'll make it more open. How, do, how is this gonna look if we do this instead? Hold on. So we're gonna grab this. We missed it. That's okay. We're gonna go through here. Also, I realize this is gonna be really exposed to like creepers and anything that just wants to walk through the window, but you know what? You know what? I don't care. <laughs> it doesn't matter that much to me. Alright, so we're gonna have to jump up here and place a block at the same time, like this. so. We'll do this. And then this will be the top part. We'll leave the roof open uh, so bees can fly in and out. We might change that a little bit so it looks doesn't look as horrific. But besides that, that's how the top of it will look. As for down here, um, we'll go ahead and fix this part, of course. We're also going to strip the outside, I guess. It's going to look real weird, but that is okay. We'll figure it out later. Um, okay, so as for the outside, or the inside, rather, I, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. We're going to do this. Okay. So down here, there's going to be a railway system to pick up all of the, uh, to pick up all of the honeycomb that gets thrown out. I'm going to go ahead and wait to put that in until the end here in a second. Um... Yeah, so I will be right back um, after this thing is built to show you guys how to put the grill in. I'll be right back. Alrighty, everyone, here we are. I think I got the exterior done. Once we get more, like, honey-type stuff, I'll be able to cover this thing in honey, and it'll look great. Or probably not great. I mean, look who's building it. Me. It will, it will never look great. But... Uh, now that the exterior is pretty much done, I mean, I'll probably change things later. I always do. Uh, now that it's quote unquote, do like the air quotes with your fingers, done. Uh, we can go ahead and work on the rail, rail system that will go underneath. And then pray the thing, this thing starts working. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go ahead and go into the inside right here. We're going to grab our rails first to avoid some problems here. We're gonna go ahead and dig in here. We're gonna go two blocks down. Like we are doing right now. And again, only two blocks, so we don't need to, I'm not trying to dig a hole to bedrock or anything. We're just trying to go a little bit down so we can get this rail system in. Sound like if, I feel like I'm trying to sound like Bob Ross in a way. I don't know if that makes any. It probably doesn't, but like it, I, I just feel like some. Sometimes I feel like Bob Ross when I'm trying to explain things. My shovel is going to break soon. That is unfortunate. Let's probably go fix that before it does break, huh? Shouldn't I? All right, I'll fix that later. Okay, so here we go. I only have six powered rails. That seems like I should probably have a little bit more than that. Uh, I'm probably not going to have enough rails to fill this thing, but that is okay. So we're going to go ahead and I guess just start putting them down. Oh yeah, we're not going to have nearly enough to fill this thing. Um, I'm going to need more rails. How am I going to do this? I didn't really stop and think how this is going to work. We're going to have to get rid of this. Okay, I'll be right back. I need to go get more rails. I, I, I can't keep going until I have more. This is going to be a fun video to edit. This side is going to be different though, so we don't need to put this in yet. That was a fox. That was horrifying. Alright, 
All right, we got the rails, and we are well rested to start putting them down. All right, so how is this going to work? Because I have no idea. So this is going to go like this. It's going to come like this. It's probably going to have to curve that way. Even so, this is gonna this is gonna be really tricky. I don't know how the heck I'm gonna get this thing to work. I also don't know how the heck I can never have the great amount of rails I need. Okay, we'll do that. Wonder if that will work. And then we'll put these two here. All right. Okay, now all of this is hooked up. So what if we, we can turn this one like this, I think? If we do this. N no, not like that. We need to do this. All right, now all this stuff is powering all of these. Uh, let's, let's Let's give that a whirl, I guess. Um, go there. So we'll go here. Alright. Like this, like that, like that. Alright, not bad, not bad. Alright, I believe all rails are down and powered. So all that's really oh not that. All that's left is putting down our minecart that I didn't grab. And uh go ahead and start powering this thing. How do I get out of here? Um It's gonna hurt. Oh, just kidding, I took zero damage whatsoever. Awesome, I am amazing. All right, we're gonna grab this. We're gonna grab more rockets, apparently. I'm gonna go ahead and throw this down here. All right, are you gonna work? Oh, I hit it on accident. All right, that's fine. Oh. All right, well, it does work, that's for sure. Oh, all right, all right, okay, all right. We took a little bit of damage that time. That's fine. All right, well, oh, I missed. All right, so now all we're going to do now is uh, go ahead and just put this floor back on. Uh, this will pick up all the blocks that was dropped. And, yeah, so we're just going to go ahead and slap this thing on real quick. And uh, it'll all be good. It'll all be fine. Alrighty, guys. So that is how you build a bee farm. My it, mine is com extremely ineffective. Like it is like probably the worst thing I've ever built in the entirety of Minecraft. But um, yeah, that's the that's the basic idea of it. Once I get some bee things like honeycomb and stuff, I can make it look a not, lot nicer. But yeah, that's how you that's that's the general idea of how you build a bee farm. Um, I'm gonna of course make it look way nicer in between episodes because I do not have the patience to do it on a video nor the brain capacity to do so. Uh, but yeah, that's how you do it. 
guys thanks for tuning in hey everybody Spectre here so I found a quick flaw in the design uh just just a minor thing right here um just gonna go, to go ahead and pile up over here I don't know when you got in here um for this redstone ignore the lever uh this uh it was like this make sure that it is not like this but instead it is on a block like so the block I don't think should matter as long as it can conduct a redstone signal but it has to be on top of a block or it will not activate the uh, the uh, dispenser here and it will not harvest the uh, honeycomb so uh, yeah we have 12 now so yeah that's how that works just don't forget that block and it should work for both bedrock and Java have fun with that uh, Spectre's tuned out see you guys